A lot of people think graduate students, the most important thing is how much they know. That's 10% of what they need. What they need to be able to do is understand what the question is, be creative, challenge the assumptions that you have going into studying that question. I always say, I want you to get me the best doctors because I know that they're gonna be students for four years and they're gonna be doctors the rest of their lives. I love science, knowing how the body works, but I want it to apply to people and make a difference with people. Get outside of industrialized countries and they still have the crime. In order for you to long-term improve the lives of people living in those areas, you've gotta have capabilities to investigate those crimes. They have need of forensic science capabilities. My faculty is quite progressive thinking and very entrepreneurial. We do a lot more in terms of teaching and mentoring than other schools I've been involved with in the past. We have the College of Osteopathic Medicine. We have the School for, of Forensic Sciences, School of Healthcare Administration, and the School of Biomedical Sciences. It's that total population of students, the medical students plus the graduate students that turns us and has created our Center for Health Sciences. Hospital administrators will say, love your graduates, we want more of your graduates. And you know, I think part of that is because the environment here is a nurturing environment. It's not a cutthroat environment. I really felt that there was a great emphasis on balance and family and creating well-rounded positions. I know everybody in my class. Our attitude is we want everybody to succeed. We all work together. Our students come here wanting to make a difference, not just in the city, but also in rural Oklahoma and rural populations. They give us that push from the start. We do a lot of community service for underserved uh, populations. It exposes students to something they would not have otherwise seen and realize how big of an impact they can make in those communities in a way that they never saw before. It's not just getting up and going to work, but getting to see what the community is like and how you're gonna build your own practice once you get out there. I'm so excited to be able to serve my community and serve the underserved um, and be able to just give back to a community that has brought me up and given me so much. That's probably the most rewarding thing for me is knowing the things that we're doing today will make a difference and they'll change the lives of Oklahomans.